Wow, look at that. Three of them. Wow. Unbelievable. Oh my god. Just hovering there. They're just sitting there, they're not moving at all. Wow, look at that. Three of them. Wow. Unbelievable. Oh my god. Just hovering there. They're just sitting there, not moving at all. So did that grab your attention? Yeah, okay, I thought it probably would. Now it's a bit different to my usual videos. I thought I'd just do something a bit wacky, because why not? It seems to be the current trend these days is to do commentaries on distractions. So, yes, uh, there's been some more footage after this, so stick around, I've got some more to show you. Right, this is, it's interesting. So, my commentary on this is UFOs, UAPs, whatever you want to call them, right? Do I believe alien life exists? Potentially, yes. I'm not against it. I don't believe they're coming here. I do believe it may exist somewhere else because it's basically on the principle that if we exist on this planet, along with all the other life that's on this planet, why is it not possible to happen somewhere else? I believe it is. So I think it's very likely that somewhere out there in the universe there is some other kind of life. Are they going to come here? Probably not. If they are advanced enough to come here, should we be worried? Yes, we should be worried because they're not going to come here to be friendly. They're going to come here to be resource grabbing. So, you know, that's what it'll be about. That's what I think. I mean, I, I need a little silver hat on. I need a little tin hat. I was going to do one, actually, but I didn't have any tin for. It's a shame. <laughs> so, yes, that's my belief on it anyway, right? I think the reason that the US military has announced this UFO existence is a distraction. Most governments will issue some kind of thing which people will be interested in as a distraction from something else that's going on. So they've done this probably because there's something else going on over here which I don't want you to notice. Anyone know what that is? I don't know. I've got no idea. But that's usually what happens, is they'll say, oh, look at this. Don't look over here. Ignore that. Die about a bit. So I think this is just a distraction. Um, Thunderfoot's done some videos showing UFOs, which are just out-of-focus planes. Um, you know, a bit of camera trickery. Yeah. Anyway, check out the next bit. You'll see what I mean. What's even more impressive is if I uh, bring the focus down, you can see that they're not UFOs at all. They're things stuck to a window. Because, you know, they can be. And you know what they are? The solder braid. Nothing more. Just rolls of solder braid stuck to a window. With a bit of sellotape. Impressive though, eh? So as you can see, with a little bit of camera trickery, you can make anything look like spaceships. Uh, you know, three UFOs hovering in space. Yeah. No. Just uh, three rolls of solder braid stuck to a window. If you believe it, you'll believe it. Um, if someone can give a plausible explanation for things, people will often ignore that. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. You know, the other thing like UFO stuff is also, there's going to be military aircraft out there which are top secret and stuff like that. You're going to be guaranteed about that. And they will deny existence of things because that's top secret. That's the whole point of you know, developing these things. And I think, believe the old, was it the old um, bomber, that stealth bomber, that got seen a few times and people wondered what the hell that was. Turned out it was that. Good example. So don't believe everything you see on film or what people tell you. Make your own decisions. Use your own brain instead of somebody else's maybe slightly twisted brain. Uh, I know my brain's slightly twisted. If it's evidenced by this video. Yeah. 
Oh well. So if aliens were to come here, I don't think it's going to be Asgard or ancient kind of aliens. I think it's going to be Vogan kind of aliens with their poetry. Vogan poetry. Back to electronics work. A bit of fun. Someone's got to jump on this bandwagon and take a bit of a piss, don't they? That's all I've got to say on the matter. Don't forget your towel. Get you later. Inception at your heart out. Videoing, videoing, or videoing.